Today's race under control from very early on. It kind of the start. No, we were we were holding back a little bit just to make sure we could see what other people were up to, and then we got going after North Head. Uh, after that, yeah, it was we were keeping an eye on the, the Cornish boys to make sure we could uh, maintain a suitable distance from them. And uh, otherwise, yes, it all went fairly comfortably. Have you done much testing over the winter? Uh, we haven't done much testing. We've done a lot of work on the boat, or I've done a lot of work. And I actually owe Miles a bit of a beer because I made some changes which made his job very hard today. What were they? So what, what, what uh, we were, I was fiddling around with drive heights and things, so it didn't actually work very well. So it meant we had a harder job at the higher speeds. But do you mean, um, is this something that you can rectify before oh, around the island? Yeah, 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 it'll be done in, in a day. So I'm going to go back to the old setup. We thought we were going to come under a bit more pressure, certainly from the Swedes. So uh, I was looking to try and increase our top speed through some RPM, which kind of worked, but it, but it meant it was difficult at the higher, at the higher So it was a, t a tougher yeah. job for Mr. Jennings <laughs> today? Mr. Jennings, yeah. It, it, it made his job a little difficult. This, the start run is always interesting here, Chris. Um, the start boat was quite wide on the start. They're probably another 200 meters further offshore than they normally are. So of course it means everybody's bottling in towards the first mark um, over on towards the Boscombe Way. And it, it, it meant that there was gonna be a little bit of a chaotic situation with all the boats funneling into the first buoy. We actually throttled back uh, intentionally to, uh, to let other boats through, hoping they'd make a few more mistakes because it's not worse, you know, it's, the, the race is not won on the first boy. And uh, not, not as many made a mess as we thought they might, but I think one or two did. Uh, and obviously through there and then we're away. The reason for the changes were, we were expecting more competition. We thought the other outer limits might be here. So I wanted to be ready to be able to, to, to improve our performance on last year. And it's great, you know, we're here to race. And racing is, is the very essence of the word, you know, we want to have competition. So the fact that one or two people have up their game is great news. You know, uh, Rob, you know, Rob has, Lockyer has bought a, a new bigger boat, same as ours, but a bit longer, a bit heavier, a bit more power. You know, if you look at it on paper, it should be a better boat overall, should be faster, should be better in the rough and all those things. So, but it's going to take time to get it all set up and running. And then, you know, when they've done that, you know, how good can they race it? You know, that's the next thing. So. We don't mind. 